Tomorrow is a big day in the Alberta Legislature. It's the final vote on Jason Kenney's bogus, no help 2022 provincial budget. It's also a confidence vote on the Premier. I can tell you that our caucus will stand on behalf of our constituents, the people who we were elected to serve, and vote against this budget. We will do so because it fails so deeply to help Albertans as they face a cost of living crisis. It also does not properly fund public education. It levels massive cuts to post-secondary and will further drive our future leaders out of the province. And it moves to actively attack public health care. Even after two years of our hospitals being pushed to the brink as a result of the COVID-19 pandemic. Even the support the government claims to provide is entirely fake in some circumstances and woefully inadequate in others. On our side of the legislature, we are listening to Albertans. We recognize that they are facing inflation costs not seen in 30 years. We recognize they're facing rising costs of everything from groceries and rent to clothing and to gas. Everything is rising. The UCP knows this, and yet they've still pressed ahead with a $1 billion tax grab on the backs of families. They've pressed ahead with policies that have spurred massive increases to car insurance, to tuition, to school fees, and to so much more. We can't support this budget because it doesn't support Albertans. It's that simple. I expect the independent MLAs, given the criticisms they have leveled, will also vote against this budget. So my question to the members of the UCP caucus is simple as well. Why wait for the UCP special general meeting? If this is really about supporting Albertans, serving their interests, and changing the leadership at the top in the form of the Premier, you have the opportunity to take a stand tomorrow and vote with us against this budget. 18 members of the government caucus is all it takes to defeat this budget and show that the legislature really has lost confidence in Jason Kenney and his incompetent leadership. I'm encouraging each UCP MLA to think long and hard today about why they were elected and to vote on their conscience tomorrow. Do the right thing. Let's get back to the drawing board on a budget that will be there for all Albertans. Let's work on a budget that recognizes we need to be smart with how we support each other in the middle of another energy boom. We need to support families, secure our economic future, keep people here, and ensure no one falls through the cracks. I can't vote for this budget. Not until I see real support for the Albertans that I was elected to serve.